Yo, 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 it's Big Ant, man. We back. Another edition of Urban Politicians TV, UPTV, man. Make sure you stay on your pivot. Out here South by Southwest, Austin, Texas. Had to come tap in with me, meet you, man. Popped out here doing your, doing your thing in the streets with it, so I had to lock in with you, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's man. Stuff, tell them where you're from and all that. Meet you, I'm from Phoenix City, Alabama. Smallest city in Alabama, Phoenix City. You're going to hear about it soon. Shit show, shit show. Nah, man, so we ain't never heard I heard of that, 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 that part of Alabama. The only thing I know about Alabama is Montgomery, That's it. Birmingham, and Tuscaloosa. And I've been, I've, been, I've been through uh, Mobile. Yeah. I done worked with some artists in Mobile uh -huh. on interviews and vlogs. So you got to give me the geographics of what go on out there. The same old, you yeah. know, nigga trying to hustle, trying to get some money. No yeah. nigga broke too. No do with that same shit. But it's small, so nobody knows us. When you come out as a rapper, it's not going to work. When you come out as a basketball, football star, though, it's quick to push behind you. So, you know, we can, in Phoenix City, you can walk the whole street in probably 10 minutes. The whole hood, the whole little Phoenix City. You walk in about 10 minutes, that small for real. Okay, okay. What, what part of town you from? Uh, the south side of Phoenix, Alabama. It's stay small. Okay. It's small. So, for so. sure. So, south. hey, what's, you got to give them the demographic, though. You know, you say it's, it's going down like that. It be turned up and shit. I mean, it be turned in, it don't be turned. I don't be out there like that. I be out there trying to help out the community. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So I'm, I hear about the little bad but there. I'm in the street trying to help out people. So, I'm in the so. schools. I'm in, you know, the homeless, all that. Oh, yeah. You're in that type I'm in that type. Okay, now nah, that's moving. what's up. That's nah, what's up. I move in the street. So, so, so you kind of like also fuck all that other street shit. You trying to put back good, good. Yeah, the it, one person got to change something. Yeah. Pop said he gonna hit one mine, ain't it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm hit. He hit that one mine. So, so. What made you just get out there and start making you go for your thing like that, bro, and inspire you and start pushing your shit for the positive instead of the negative, man? Uh, I mean, I ain't no killer. Yeah. I see, when I'm growing up, I just see how we didn't have it, so yeah. I see another person out here not having it. I want to help. I used to wake up in the morning and trying to get some change from the from the, uh, the couch, trying to get a, a big chicken sandwich when they were dollar and eight. Yeah, me and my home, but we get two dollars in that bit. Oh, man, we just split it. Ain't, ain't, ain't that big of a deal, but yeah. it's like I just want to be on the positive side. Yeah. Like, I want to get more. I ain't, I ain't not here robbing and stealing. They ain't the only thing to do. Yeah, yeah. So you say y'all had to straight change together to find yeah. some meat. Uh, Your parents was going through it or yeah. you just had some like... Shit, my mom and dad were good, but they didn't have it like that. Yeah. The apartment was, was fucked up, raggedy, like a crackhead home. Yeah. Uh, we had to find a way. So, sure, so, sure, man. So your parents, they still they still alive and everything? My daddy did, my mom. My mom's still alive. Okay. I'm bad to see you. For so, sure, for so, sure. But they, they they see you out here doing something for the better. Oh, yeah, yeah. She always check up on me, make sure she like what I'm doing. She had to be safe. She's scared. Yeah. She's nah, scared, bro. We scared. We out here. We rocking. So we oh, jump yeah. to the music thing, man. Uh, around... 17 trying to find my way, yeah. but the way somebody else wanted me route, that shit wasn't working. So yeah. around about 21, 22, I looked at what I need to be writing about, what I was already doing. Yeah. So, but uh, the person that really put me in a little sleep. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, with the no label situation, bro, you gotta explain that. You know what I'm saying? Family, unity. Yeah, that's the record label right there, man. Tapped in, we out here. So now, nah, you know, no label, how everything came together with y'all joining the music and, and trying to make this thing work and stuff, things like that. Uh, I met um B, that's my manager. I met him first, and we linked up. Told me to meet him at a barber shop, and we hooked up. Then I had met uh B, Ray. Uh, Tony, Mackie, Ying, all them like later on, and it was all you know just love. I ain't seen nothing fake out of it, so I'm still here. I ain't going nowhere. Yeah, yeah, y'all rocking, man. Y'all sure know right. what y'all supposed to do. I just seen y'all on the corner getting it in, moving as a unit. That's how you gotta do. So with the music, man, you gotta tell them what to tap in there with this. Uh, tap in on Instagram. Yeah. No label meet you. No label M E C H I be on the 24/7. Even if you wanna talk, I'll talk to you. No matter what you going through, and my music tap in on YouTube. You you go on my Instagram and find out my music. I steady be on them, dropping something, you know, to try to stay connected to everybody. No label meet you, man. And uh, what song you were sending to? You want niggas this, this that one? Hey, I'm easy. Not... So long. So long. So long. No label. And Whoa. you need to play that. You need so, to play that for you even. I'm gonna check it out. You get in the car or something. We gonna check it out. So so what what you think rapper gonna make somebody go go to that song and tap in with it, bro? What make them want to? Yeah. What's what's what it got to? What what's the vibe on? Motivation. When you come from the bottom, it always away. My lady told me that. My fiance told me that one time. She, she tell me that every time. Like when you down on something, you feel like you, you know, you, you can't go up no more. Like you just said, for some reason, you gonna find a way about that situation. Yeah. 
sure. She told me that. Yeah. Nah, we tapped in, man. So what you think is the biggest thing going on in Alabama that can be better for y'all to turn up as a whole state? Because y'all got a buzz going right now out there Mobile. Them, they said Mobile, them. man. It's yeah. like, yeah, Mobile popping, but I feel like Alabama already needs to show love to every city. Yeah. Like, me personally, I want to work with everybody in Alabama. Yeah. I ain't got no, you know, I just want to, you know, get it. So everybody needs to stop just feeling like, oh, I don't know him, I don't know this net. Yeah. It's everybody... going to come, though. This is how it be, you know, once they get it. Yeah. The door, they gonna, once they get all the way in that door, because they got to get all the way in the door. That's how the game go. It be yeah, hard yeah. to do that shit. And I, and I know that now, too, like me doing this shit for a couple years, like the niggas really be tied up and trying to make their shit kick off. Yeah, yeah. they can just go grab other things up. Shit, nigga going to see you and notice you. Keep pushing your shit and everything, man. One more time, give them the Instagram. Instagram, no label meeting. No label M-E-C-H. Tap in right now, trust me. You gonna, you gonna, you gonna wish you tapped in. So sure. quick. Got it.